that the same armor you got from the rolling guy? Yeah. Pain Train build. It's kind of a cute name for it. <laughs> Stack Scarlet Rot plus Bleed. It's just... The Bleed... Oh! I see what's going on. I forgot my Arcane's super low here. Oh! That... Oh! Yeah, I can't decide what build to switch to. Because we're going to switch because I think it's too easy mode with Night and Flame. Like, there hasn't really been the challenge for a little while, so I just can't decide what to go to next. I'm thinking maybe the Moonlight Greatsword will be a fun one. I'm looking up other, like, potentially fun ones. Dual Shield Wall Build. Kind of a cute idea. I actually, I kind of like that. Just like a full-blown shield build. Is it tier one coffee and the resub ploop and the bits dino? Dual shield Dumbo tank build. That could be kind of fun. Let's see. Is there any dual shield builds already? So I think the play will be... Where are my shields? Okay, I think we'll do the spiked shield as my main hand. And then for my offhand, we'll do... What's like my strongest shield in general? Oh, so this is what the tree sentinel uses. It reflects all projectiles. Oh, that'll probably be good then. So I think I have a cool idea. I'm gonna pump... Uh, all Vigor, Endurance, and Strength. And Arcane. Because I'm gonna go for Big Bleed on the Spike Shield as main hand. And I, I was watching a quick video while shitting. Yeah, I can just do guard counters with my shield. So if I block, I can immediately counter with this. And I'll stack Bleed and break Poise. And then I can switch to like... I don't know. Some like heavy weapon to do the actual shit. Alright. That looks to be good. All right, I'm ready to ride. <laughs> I already know I'm gonna fucking regret this. This is gonna be unusably bad. Oh my God, this needs faith. I should have read. Shit. <sighs> it's okay. Uh, immediately just gonna make a, a quick change here. Hey, we'll just go to we'll just go to Dragon Claw. Hey, this looks this looks cooler anyway, honestly. Oh baby! And then I get health back on every single one of those. I think this is gonna be good. All right. The immortal blood-sucking onion vampire. Oh, you get so much health back? Excuse me? That was a lot. This is feeling pretty good. This would be so toxic in PvP. Yeah, it probably would. Alright, alright. I'm kind of liking this. This can work. I will not be able to kill dragons anymore, though. <laughs> That's for damn sure. I really do wonder how this will do against bosses. I can't imagine it being that great. It's probably not trash, but it's, pro it's probably not very good either. More Elden Ring. Oh, here we go. No, it's it's a lot. Are you good at it? All right, come on, baby. Let's see how this goes. What did you say? Are you good at it? Yeah. Best in the world. I'd say I'm up there. I believe it. Okay, not going super well so far for the dual shields. In the best in the world. It's very hard to hit this guy with the shield. I thought it'd be a fun build. The shield fight? Holy shit. 
I feel like that can't do much damage. Ooh, what the fuck? Useless attack, but kind of cool. No, uh... We're in a pretty good spot right now. By that I mean we've done almost no damage. It'll take a little while, but we'll get there. I'll have him staggered pretty soon. <laughs> this thing just fucking sucks. <laughs> this club is terrible. Just stagger him, Christ! <laughs> Please! You would think that this giant fucking club would be good at staggering- Oh god, I'm out of rhythm. I've been buffering dodges by accident. I wonder how many hits I landed on him, it had to be like over a hundred. This club is trash. Even at like- Plus zero. I know it's not leveled, but it still doesn't do anything to justify its massive strength requirement. What's the art? <laughs> I see. Not a very good art. I already did the naked build and people kept whining about being naked, so we're not going back to the naked build. We're trying the super tanky onion build. This is the worst boss that could have happened for the dual shield onion. Because I don't have a backup strength weapon. Nice! We're looking good! Giant caveman club! Popping off now! Oh. That's so unlucky. I'd already buffered that roll. What a shame. Alright, let's put on the jump talisman. We'll be fine. Nice. Four jump attacks for the stagger. Pretty good. Big caveman build. Oh, shit. Uh-oh. You fucked up. Now it's my time, baby. Nice. That big back-to-back -back stagger action. That's how we do it, pussy. There we are. Back to dual shields. Hopefully this time I won't get a giant boss. I'll get a smaller one so I can actually try the dual shield build. Oh fuck. That was a rough run. Yeah, I don't think the uh, I don't think the daggers are gonna get it done here. Oh, what? Claws are still the best, even after all this time, unupgraded. I'm just gonna switch this build immediately. Well, actually, I'll get the, uh, Redan Swords first. <clears throat> and then we'll try it with that, but otherwise I'm just gonna switch the build. It's just not very good, even as a meme. There. Ooh, I get Hoslo's full set, eh? Maybe these scale- nope. <laughs> I thought maybe there's a chance that they scale with, uh, strength. Oh, well, I can't do double whip yet. Looks like I'll have to do another playthrough and kill him for the second whip. Well, I guess I could just use a different whip, like the other whip. Another one of these death birds. Oh, Jesus.
Yeah, I guess I'm gonna be fat rolling if I do the full Lionel. I'll have to put on the, uh, Godkin top. Oh my. Oh, didn't expect that move. This club is just not good, man. But we'll get it with it anyway. No, this club is at plus five. It just sucks. It's just really slow, and it doesn't do much damage. Even at plus five and 36 strength. Damn, oh shit. Bad roll. Nice. Oh my god, let me up. Oh, beautiful. Looking good. What in the fuck is happening? What am I... God damn. Popping off. This guy is actually harder than the normal versions. Alright. Let's test these babies out. Let me see the weapon art. Well, that was unlucky. I missed immediately. Jesus! Oh my god, just get the fuck out. Oh, you got me fucked up. There we go. Not bad. Pretty decent run here. Oh god, fuck it. Yep, I couldn't- oh my god, I couldn't get out in time. I was gonna try and tank through it with an Estus, but I couldn't get it off. Yikes, what a sad run. You're too slow. Well, yeah, man. It's an ultra great sword. What do you expect? If it was upgraded more, it'd be... A lot different. The damage would be worth the slow trade-off. The God Freeze Axe, once you kill him, is great for strength builds. Is it better than the Redans? I can't imagine it would be. Oh, what? Uh-oh, shit. Close. Man, that little fire- oh, I'm dead. That little fire he leaves behind lasts so long, and it's on every attack. Whoa! <laughs> Alright, that's sad. Not much I could actually do there. So where does that fire go? Just like the entire map? Where's the safe spot from that fire? God damn. No. Oh, God damn it. Dodge too late. Chat made you pick this build? Uh, no. Chat just really wanted me off the faith build because it was too strong. When I killed Margit in two tries, chat got very upset. And I was fine to switch because it's like, yeah, I get it. It is a little busted. Oh, no, no, no. Oh, God. Yep, yep. Saw that coming. I even dodged the explosion. It's just the flames he leave behind kill me in two shots. Damn. Coming up on a really neat katana you can do a blood build on. I know what katana you're talking about. What, isn't it just better to put just the blood art on pretty much any other katana? I heard that katana is not very good. Use the Prime JQ. Use the weapon art. This? I don't think that's going to be that great for this boss, but you know what? Sure. I feel like that's just going to root me for a long time and get me killed, but you want it? We'll do it. Oh shit, I'm stuck. Do I just have to guess correctly where to go? For where the flames won't be? Oh. 
Shit! Oh. Oh my god, he's gonna despawn himself. He's stuck. Oh, never mind. He came back down. Oh my god. Don't. Not like this, man. Come back. Not much I could do there. He trapped himself up top. Oh, Jesus. What? He can do that twice? Oh. Looking pretty good. Out of stamina. That's a little unlucky. I need to get some distance. I'm not going to fight him up there. I already know I'm going to fall off the map. And I'm going to be very sad when that happens. Pretty good. Need to get him away from that fire. There we go. First try. I cannot wait to get the fuck off of this build. God, that guy was nuts. Alright. I think we'll just go back to a glass cannon type build. Because even with full armor, most things still kill me in two, maybe three attacks. So we'll just go back to just full damage. Let me get a grace, though. I don't think any build is too OP. Summons, though, is. Yeah, maybe. Alright. Um... So arcane scaling doesn't work with bleed, apparently. It's a bug. <clears throat> we did the night and flame build, and it was absolutely nuts. Um. Oh, Blasphemous Blade is from a boss soul. Which one? Who gives it? It's for killing Riker. Oh, okay, well that'll be perfect then. So we'll go kill him, and then I'll get the Blasphemous Blade. Okay, we traded. Shit, not against the wall, not against the wall. Do I, I think I just have to jump that, right? I can't outroll it. No fucking way. You goddamn pussy! Thanks for resub Malachi and the Prime Twistin' the resub Seth. Yeah, his second phase is super cool. Some crazy pollo. The bits get off. Character design, what the fuck? Yeah, it's amazing. God, he's so cool. That's such a shame, I was out of range. No oh, shit, the lava! Fuck, fuck, fuck! Oh, if I do a Mimic Summon right now, that'd be so cool. I'm not going to, but it would be cool. Because then we'd have two people using the Gimmick Blade. Holy shit. God, he's so cool. Please do the mimic summon. Yeah, I mean, it is a gimmick boss. Yeah, fuck. I, I really want to see it. Yeah, we'll do mimic on this. It is just a gimmick boss. It, that's There's no shame there. I really want to see this. Imagine he can't actually use the, like, the special effect on it, so he has to just go up into the lava and just manually poke him. Nope, he's immediately using the special. Oh, you can't even jump that. What the fuck? 
Oh, man. Mimic's getting fucked up. Bro, use the effect. He is just hanging out in the lava. There you go. There, that's free. He has not gotten a successful one off yet because he just hangs out in the lava. Hey, good work, buddy. My man, looking good. Looking real good out there. We did it. He didn't land a single hit. He immediately charged the lava and kept trying to spam. Shit, he's still going. Oh, that was clutch. Nice. Mimic got off a single attack, I think. Just one. That was a cool gimmick, though. That was a very cool gimmick, boss. This is the best build you made so far? Bro, this build sucks. <laughs> it's fucking trash. I don't have any good weapons right now. It's just pure strength and vigor, but the health pool isn't really all that great for me. My best build was the Sword of Night and Flame, where I could actually just melt everything. Volcano Manor disbanded. Only thing left in the quest is to kill her and get unique armor. Yeah, I guess there's just no benefit to not killing her. Here I come. Brace. Oh. Whoops. Oh. He hit me with the me too there. Did the same fucking thing basically. What the fuck is that? Oh my god. Alright. Full consort, I guess. That's cool. Plus, the majority of my playthrough has been played at a really, really low vigor. And I had didn't notice a single difference going at high vigor. Holy shit, that's cool. Just basic attacks set on fire. Oh my god, that's nutty. This is gonna be kinda nice. Let's resub AO, man. Oh, I can one-shot these guys now. I wish I could get off the fire. I'm actually just healing myself on the fire. Come back. Yeah. Oh, oh wait, these are... I, I forgot where I was. These are pretty low-level enemies. I was gonna say, what the fuck? Alright, let's see how this bad boy does against the boss. Oh! It's just a repeat boss, and he is getting fucked hard. I'll, I'll show mercy on you. I won't use the what? Oh! To be fair, those are just two normal enemies. To be fair, that was still kind of cool, though. Stop. Jesus. Fuck. Stop, man. I am just passing through. Alright. Back-to-back bosses. Another Black Knife Assassin. Oh, this one's invisible. Oh, wow. Uh, what? Is this on purpose, or...? Oh, there we go. Oh, Jesus. Man, this poor guy's still getting fucking rocked even while invisible. Here he is. <gasps> oh, there you are. Damn it. I heard you. I'm feeling him around. There he is. Gotcha. Outplayed, kid. Sorry. Gamer instinct is too strong. 
Ah, uh, here we go. Hey! A new Mariner! The first Mariner is like the pinwheel of Elden Ring. Oh, holy shit, he summons a fat skeleton. There he is. I see you! Yeah! 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 <laughs> this poor guy doesn't do anything. He's a boss that's like not programmed to fight. Oh shit! I say that and here he comes! Ah! Good fight. The Mariner always brings the thrills, I'll tell you what. Oh. Don't do it. You son of a bitch. You slimy devil. Oof. This is really hard here. I want to kill him. I don't want to just run by him. Oh! That step back lunge is so sad. Ugh. Thanks to Prime John and G Burns. Shit. Oh, that was lucky. There we go. We got him. Oh! No! That was close. I didn't realize I was out of FP. Only 6,000 runes for that. Wow. Why is he scaled up so high for only 6k runes? That doesn't make any fucking sense. Holy shit. He had over 8k health. Jesus. Oh, I can't even summon the Mimic here to speed it up. Oh, because I don't have enough health. There we go. Yeah. Speed run. It wasn't the best, was it? It was the highest defensive body armor I have. By a long shot. Even more so than Redan's. Keep it up, Mimic. You're doing great. Does this reach the whole way, I wonder? My god, it does. Excellent teamwork, Mimic. God, Mimic is fucking that guy up. To be fair though, this guy's kinda weak. I got you covered. Nice. We make such a good team, Jesus Christ. 